A fast-moving winter storm turns downtown Asheville into a virtual ghost town. Yeah, several businesses were forced to close early today because of icy conditions and a lack of customers. News 13's Megan Shearing's live in downtown Asheville tonight with more. Megan. Well, hey there, guys. We are live from Broadway Street in downtown Asheville. And as you can see, there are a few uh, bars and restaurants open here tonight. I did talk with the owner of Tressa's. She decided to stay open be despite the weather, but she says she is operating on a skeleton crew. Other business owners down here I talked with today, they say it wasn't worth it to stay open. Say it ain't so. Three o'clock on a Friday. Yeah, it's usually a lot busier this time of day on a Friday. And downtown Asheville is dead. What up with that? Mother Nature is what's up. And so we sat there and kept wondering what we were going to do. And I guess we sat long enough that it, a car warmed up the area or something. We eventually kind of spun our way out and got over it. A winter ice storm turned city streets into a skating rink. It was major street ice uh, on the sidewalks and every place. The hairy conditions downtown. I probably go home by 4 o'clock just to get home before dark. Forced store after store after store after store after store to close for the day. I mean, it's more important for our folks to get home than it is for everybody to get a piece of chocolate. Yeah, I'll clear your table. How about that? Homegrown on Merriman even quit cooking two hours early. We're completely dead. We're not making any money. It's also for the safety of um, our customers and for the safety of the people that work here. The day disappointing for some. We wanted to check out all these beautiful stores and see the gallery walk, and they're all closed but a delightful experience for others. Yes, I'm at Hotel Indigo, and that's open bar and bistro. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's, a, good, it's a good thing. Even though an hour later, things started to return to normal. That's why I never believe the weather forecast. <laughs> Don't tell Jason that. <laughs> oh, oh, always look out the window. Now, all the businesses that we spoke with today that did close early, they told me that they will be back open at their regular hour tomorrow and trust says that is just behind me that is open tonight they say they're staying open until two o'clock this morning reporting live in downtown Asheville tonight Megan Sherry news 13.